Sarpe also expressed his disappointment in the slavery situation in Libya and said he is not surprised that the Minister of International Relations and Cooperation, Nitumba Nandin Daitwa, is silent on the matter. As a few days ago, there was a mess of slavery sale in Libya. Again, our diplomats and Nitumba Daitwa, responsible for foreign affairs, was silent. Very topical. Very topical. This is betrayal. This is betrayal. But what was considered to be a, an exercise of centuries ago is relived right on our shores. The African Union is not very strong, and other countries, both in SADC and in uh, Eastern and West Africa, are also not very strong on this issue. Silence. Absolute silence. Meanwhile, the LPM has launched a student command element in order to address shortcomings in the education sector in the coming years. Well, uh, as we all know that Namibia has been rated as a junk status like a few months ago. So this is actually a concern for us as students because this, this basically means that once we graduate, there is no jobs. And most of the people that graduated they have not been employed ever since last year. So it's, this is actually a concern. So this will basically um, result into brain drain, which Namibia will lose a lot of professionals that have studied in Namibia to go look for uh, jobs in other countries, meaning Namibia will be left with illiterate people that will not be able to kickstart the, the economy of the country. LPM's Henny Sebeb questioned the national broadcaster, NBC's loyalty, and said they must be fair to everyone and not just air selective content. Now, when, when a public broadcaster takes a decision deliberately only to support the ruling party, mm. they are also part and parcel of that corruption. Mm. In fact, they must tell us whether the people should continue to pay the TV licenses or not. Mm. We must be told because LPM members also want to see and hear their leaders on TV. Mm. But they have been cut out. Yeah. So we must be told. Or else should we approach the High Court and then this thing that they use, allocation of time. I know, uh, uh, I mean, that, that is even an unfair uh, uh, judgment. It's nonsense. It's nonsense because it's a public broadcaster. It must cover everyone fair. When asked about LPM turning into a political party, Sorboy responded by saying they have a big announcement coming up in February next year.